Hi, this is a tutorial for our FPV drone asset on the Unreal Marketplace. You can check it out with the link in the description. The asset comes already with a pre-configured drone, like you see on the right side, but it's also possible to change it where you to make it more agile or create a new drone with a custom mesh. The drone on the right side inherits the functionality of the parent pawn, which is on the left side here. So it's much easier to um, create a multiple set of drones with all the base functionality. Now I'm showing you how to create your own custom drone. So for the custom drone, I create a new folder. Call this one custom drone. And in here I create a new blueprint class. And I don't select one of the common type. I want it to derive from the parent drone, so I'm searching for FPV pawn and select the pawn FPV drone right here and call this custom drone. So you see it takes the mesh from the parent pawn. So how you can customize this drone now. On the one hand you can set the aesthetics uh, with the skeleton mesh. Um, I imported already a skeleton mesh, which is used for the other drone, which can be used here as well. And also um, you can set the properties of the drone. So I have here drone variables and I want to make a drone which is a little bit more agile. So I want to be able to add more force. So I can setting the drone variables under the custom drone pawn icon here and maybe give it a value instead of 180, 220 and a little bit more thrust, which should be 400. Then I hit compile and save. And now I can uh, use this pawn and select it for the game mode right here. So under pawn, select pawn class, um, I select now custom pawn. And now if I hit play, I should fly my new drone, which should be more agile. So let's give it a try. I need to turn on my controller. Now I can fly this course. So thank you for watching, um, if you like this video please share and subscribe and also if you want to know um, how to create a uh, own custom drone as with a different mesh then you could leave a comment for letting us know. Thank you.